I don't even smoke weed, but I feel how when I'm next to you, babe. Used to be my girl, used to be my boot thing. Now I'm telling everybody you my boot thing, you my boot thing. What is good, everybody? Welcome back to another video. So, if y'all did not know, I organized a shoe drive for the holiday season for people who need it most. Well, basically, I partnered with the organization souls for souls and we did a little shoe drive and i made a video of that journey of me making that shoe drive and the whole process of going through it i had a lot of late nights organizing this and a lot of hours put into this rather than reselling and making youtube videos well i did make youtube i i did make a youtube video while doing it but it's just like i couldn't edit and do my other videos but basically this was something that i wanted to do because i'm in a position where i'm fortunate enough to help others so why not give it to the people who need it most y'all feel me so basically here's that video and here's the whole journey of me organizing this shoe drive with social souls and i hope y'all enjoy it because i did and more to come in the future and i appreciate y'all for watching and okay video <laughs> basically quick backstory i wanted to do something for thanksgiving where i wanted to like give shoes or do something because i already did a giveaway and i wanted to do something again but like bigger and i didn't really know what to do and i was walking into like my rec center at my college and i seen this box right and the box said something something about a shoe drive and like uh, giving away shoes and i was like oh. like a light bulb just dinged in my head and i was like yes i'm doing that and when i got home i looked at the website and i looked at the organization and i was like yes i am doing a shoe drive because giving back to people who need it most on thanksgiving like that that is something i could get behind and so literally right now i today's monday on friday i emailed souls for souls that i wanted to participate in a shoe drive and they just got back to me now they just got back to me now saying that i'm good to go and basically I need to like have a drop off zone where like people could drop off their shoes. Cause I don't want to do my personal address. Cause that, you know, that's like risky. So I just emailed my YMCA that's like local to me that I literally, my whole life I've been raised in that YMCA. Cause I played basketball. I like did everything on that YMCA. I spent all my after school hours there, mornings there. So I would love to like have little drop off zones at that YMCA. Cause it's just like, it'd be cool. It'd be cool seeing some like a place that I grew up in doing something and I'm like, partnering with that organization you feel me i don't know if that makes sense but basically right now we're waiting on word from the malden ymca to hit me it back up once they do we'll go from there but yeah i'll keep y'all updated all right y'all some great news i was just editing my video here and i called my ymca to to get confirmation if it's okay to use their location as a drop off zone and they did say yes so we are about to we about to have the drop off zone at the malden y i really appreciate that they let me do this but now we, we're just gonna make a poster and i think my sisters could help me out with that but yeah i'm excited y'all all right y'all so my sister made the poster and take a look at it guys i think it looks really good and look that looks nice the little collab little collab and oh shoot my messages oh my god you guys can see my private messages oh no oh no but yeah it looks nice so right now what i'm trying to do is i'm trying to get this printed out as soon as possible i have a poster i'm trying to get a poster but right now it's not fitting so um she sent me a new one that's like smaller dimensions i'm gonna get this up and then i'm gonna go tomorrow to the ymca to put this up and then i'm gonna have an instagram post ready for this as well stay tuned for that because i am so excited for this shoe drive i don't know i'm just excited y'all i'm happy to be able to give back be in the position that i'm in so stay tuned peace out but yeah you know we started with a process she started with a really really rough draft and i would just provide my criticisms and what i saw fit you know you see here are a few prototypes i would try to give her like a sense of direction so we ended up getting to this point and then we went through different renditions and then we ended up finally with this <laughs> this low-key might be huge the lightly worn sneakers that you guys want want to donate all right y'all it is 5 a.m I just spent the entire night editing the video in the post and editing the caption. I'm gonna have it up by Sunday at like 12 p.m. So I'm gonna get as much rest as I can. So peace out. I don't even smoke weed, but I feel how when I'm next to you, babe. Used to be my girl, used to be my boot thing. Now I'm telling everybody you my boot thing, you my boot thing. I don't even smoke weed, but I feel how when I'm next to you, babe. Running shoes. Is that 
Boston? They are tough. Are those curries? I don't know what they are actually. Oh, they might. I don't know. What is that logo? Might be like Chris. Oh, no. CN. Who's CN? Oh, is this like Cam Newton or something? Yeah, it is. These are nice. Yeah, they are. Right now we at Home Depot getting some shipping boxes for the shoe dry. I'm gonna get, I'm gonna probably get the biggest one. Probably get like two to three boxes. Actually, I'll get like five and see how much I need. So yeah, so we got five of the larger boxes. That'll be more than enough, so. Time to go pack them up. All right, y'all. Check out all these donations that we got here. Got a lot of boxes. These is full of shoes. All of these bags are full of shoes. So many donations. So I'm gonna lay them all out right across here. I'm gonna lay them all out and then take like a fire picture. So stay tuned, stay tuned, stay tuned, stay tuned, stay tuned. Come on. Hey, I know what you like, yeah. When she get with me, she get excited. Uh, I'ma hold it down just for the night, yeah. If it feels good, then girl, don't fight. Looking at her phone, she trying to hide it Once she open up, that's when she ride it mm, Ride it like a bike Riding in a Hummer Okay, then little mama Take care out in Perry, then we gone for the Alright y'all, take a look at all these shoes, man. Thank y'all for donating. Really means a lot. All the locals uh, around my area who donated, appreciate y'all for real. We really better make a change for a whole lot of people. Basically, we got our shipping boxes here. And I bought five. I'm pretty sure five would be enough, but... Yeah, we're just gonna pack all these up. Oh, we're probably gonna take an Instagram post too, you know? But I just wanted to say, guys, like, if you guys have a platform online, you can always use it for good. You know, if you have a following or like if you just have like a thousand followers, you know, that's a thousand people that you can help donate to a good cause or something like that. So it's just like, if you have a platform, just use it. There's so much that you could do in this world and so many people that actually need help. Like some people don't even have a pair of shoes that they can wear consistently and reliably. Like that's crazy to me. Like I, I have a bunch of personal. So it's just like, it doesn't feel right knowing that like somebody else in this world doesn't have a shoe that they can constantly wear. Like one of their worries is just having a shoe that's not gonna break apart on them, you know? If y'all got a platform, man, y'all can use it for good. Cause look at this. I only have like 4,000 followers on Instagram. And we was able to raise over 150 pairs of shoes. So it's just like, y'all can make a change you know, if, if you all really want to. So I thought five shipping boxes would be enough, but still got a bunch left. So if I go Home Depot and get another box, just got the extra boxes. We better go crazy. Seven full packages. Let's get them. Let's get them. Let's get them looking nice. Yes, sir. This is crazy. Seven boxes full of sneakers. Damn, it's almost as tall as me. All right, we're going to get some pictures and then, oh my gosh, the shipping labels are going to be so much. If they're all 50 pounds, they're like $50. So that's that's 350 of shipping. That's crazy, but we we doing this for a good cause. So we we going that's crazy though. 350? 350 crazy. But we doing it for a good cause. So we going to get those shipping labels done and then we going to ship them out to UPS. Just all right, right now we got our shipping labels created and also filling out these donation forms saying how many pairs I have in the thing. I put my address so I can't really show it, but 156 total pairs and all thanks to y'all so i appreciate y'all so much for this it's crazy like i don't even have that many followers or like that many uh subscribers at the time i did this 
So just like, just goes to show that anybody who has a following can do something for good. Hey, there's people who are really less fortunate than you, so might as well help them out if you can. If you're in a position to help, then might as well help. But hey, that's my rant for the day. Um, I'm gonna finish this up and then put these in the shipping boxes, the donation forms, and then I'm gonna put the shipping labels up and I'm, I'm, I'm gonna ship them out probably today or tomorrow. It just depends if the UPS drop-off zone is open or not. But yeah, I'm gonna catch y'all. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. We got shipping labels on all seven boxes. About to ship these all out. Everybody who donated, I appreciate y'all. Everybody who liked, shared, I appreciate y'all. Seriously, couldn't have done it without y'all. And yeah, let's let's get these people the shoes that they need. So we about to go ship them out right now. Got everything loaded up. We on the way, baby.